Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So as you can probably tell by the title, today's video is not makeup related, not vlog related. It's a little bit more deeper than that. So I'm going to be talking about life. I'm not giving it, I'm just going to talk about life. So if you're not interested and if you don't want to hear me get quite deep and um, it's quite emotional, like I don't cry, but it's quite emotional and dealing with some real issues, don't watch, like that's fine. I know that I'm always posting about makeup videos which is fine but this is something else that I really want to use my voice and my channel for because it's something that's really important to me take care of yourselves love one another okay bye amazing talking about your how you feel is so amazing because once you open up you realize that you aren't alone you are not alone you're dealing with somebody who's a negative influence in your life that has a massive contribution to the way that you are feeling they always make you feel like you are not worth it i'll quote something that always got told to me when i was younger is the fact that what are you going to do call that 1-800 number when because you're upset or you're sad you, you know you kids have got it too easy these days um they won't care about you they don't care what are you going to do like you have too much freedom you're too lucky i always got told that my problems or the way I was feeling was normal because I was the child I was the child and they were the adult and they had the right to do that no one no one whether it's your mother grandmother boss no one has the right to make you feel bad about yourself no one never ever forget it no matter how much they try and make you feel that way because sure as shit People have made me feel that way. People have made me question who I am and I still do it. They have made me feel, people have made me feel like I am not a good person and I am not worthy and I'm not, it's not okay for me not to be sad because other people have got it better, than, like worse than me. That doesn't matter, guys. You could live in a mansion, drive the nicest car, have everything you want in your whole entire, like anyone that you want, but if you aren't happy, you're a fucking human being it's okay it's okay and if you feel guilty for feeling sad and feeling sorry for yourself that's probably a good thing because it shows that you actually care you actually care you go oh, like sometimes I go how dare I feel bad because I've got everything but it actually makes me go okay at least I know at least I know that I have all these things but no one has the right to make you feel bad ever okay for example, let's just say that someone who is bullying you or making you feel upset, they write you a message. Delete it. Delete it. I never used to do that because I used to like to, because I always feel like I need to go over and over and over these things to make sure what I did wrong or, you know, they are purely, those things that are getting you upset are purely there to make you upset. They're purely there. They say these things and if you get it in writing, it's good. They're purely there because they want you to feel bad. They want they want that outcome from you. They want you to start questioning how you are. They go, shit, like, am I such a bad person? Do I, like, if you keep on reading that, you believe that because majority of the time you care about the person that is hurting you. Because otherwise, why would you care? If, like, Bob Joe on the street said that I was a whore or fat, I'd be like, Pfft. Whatever, you're just jealous because I get to eat cronuts and I don't care. Um, but if it's somebody that you care about, of course those words are going to hurt. Again, you're human. You have compassion. You care. Delete it. The first thing, get rid of it. And talk to somebody. Talk to a lot of people. Talk to your friends that have gone through it. Talk to a doctor. That's what my journey is. And they were all, like, you need to be around people that are going to be positive. And get rid of all the negativity in your life. And if you can't, like... If you can't because you live with that person and you have no other option and you're stuck, I know that feeling. Figure out an exit plan to get yourself out of that situation because it's only going to make you feel worse. Get yourself out of the situation. Please, just please, from the bottom of my heart, please know that it's not you. It's not you with the problem. It's not you. And if you if you misbehave or if you've done something bad, and if you're young, like, we all make mistakes. We are human beings. I've made mistakes. I've done the wrong thing before. But it does not mean that someone should make you feel less than you are. And you're not going to have love from somebody. Don't be around them. They aren't worth your time. You are only you. Do not feel sorry for who you are as a person because you are amazing and you are unique. And you have to take the good with the bad. Not everyone is perfect. Not everyone is happy all the time. We have feelings. We're emotional. That's who we are. We are made this way. And there's always reasons for why you are that way. 
And I know for a reason, the reason why I have to deal with all these things and so much emotion is because I feel like I'm lucky to have that much emotion. I'm lucky to care, but it comes with a prize. Everything comes with a prize. I get so excited about a bronzer. Like, you know, I'm like, oh my God, this bronzer, guys. Like, this bronzer. It's like I just gave birth to this bronzer. But with that said, I can get upset and I get extremely upset. So with good comes the bad and there's always a light to a negative but you, I'm just trying to learn and let's try and learn together how to focus on that and if we have our dark days we're allowed to have our dark days but just try like I when I get upset like I just know I can't let myself get to that point of up, like getting that upset because it ruins me the only person I'm hurting is myself and I don't want to do that anymore I don't want to do it I don't and do you know what, guys? I, I don't have to anymore. And that is so, so, so good because there was so much that I had to put up with because I didn't have any other option. I promise you, I did not have another option and I had to put up with it. And I just want you guys to know that someone said this to me and it makes perfect example, a perfect sense that these people that are so negative and hateful in their life, that's a perfect example how you don't want to live your life. And that hit the nail on the head because I don't want to live my life like that. That just goes to show how unhappy they are, that they want to make somebody else feel that bad about themselves. That's disgusting. But it's their issue. That's their life. They've chosen to live a life that these people choose to live. Like, every, they, everyone has a choice. And you do too. Leave the situation leave it. If you can't work out a plan how to leave it, we are so lucky to have so much support. And please guys, do not let them make you believe that there isn't help or they're not going to care about your help. That is master manipulation right there. That is so, so, so manipulative to go, no one will care about your issue. That is fucking bullshit. I promise I'm looking you dead in the eye. I'm looking at you one to one. That is bullshit. If you're upset and hurt over something, who gives a fuck what it is? They have hurt you deeply. Someone cares. Someone's there to listen. No issue is too small or too large. There is help out there. Never feel scared to do that. If you don't do it around them, hide it. Do not give them that satisfaction as well. Do not give them the satisfaction what they're after. Do not let them see that you are hurting. Be strong inside and hurt later. Because if you let them see they have control over you, they know they have that control. They are that sad within themselves that they get off the fact that you are scared, that you are... They, ha they love control. They love control because they're nasty, nasty people that don't have any control over their own life because they're unhappy. That's their choice to be unhappy. They'll use every excuse under the book. They'll they'll blame you. I have been blamed for many things. Just know that you're not alone and your problem is not small. It's your life. If you feel sad, whether you're rich, poor, have everything, have nothing, it's your story. It's your life. You're upset. You're having these feelings. Never, ever feel like someone can make you feel less important or ungrateful or anything like that because again prick you and you bleed we're all human beings and just know that somebody is always there I'm there there's people on the phones that you can call there's your doctor there are so many people out there just I know it's scary I know it's so scary because you think that they might find out or um you might feel embarrassed about your situation but it's better if you get help because it's only going to help you in the long run. And life is hard, but we need to learn. Like, life is hard. I'm not going to put this on my Instagram or um, Facebook because I just want this be to be between us. Not just about makeup here. Like, I don't want this YouTube to be about makeup. It's never just been about makeup. It's been about teaching you guys how to feel good about yourself, whether that be with makeup, whether that be with hair. And now I want to get deeper than that because I want it to have some purpose. I don't want it just to be purely cosmetic. And I just want to leave about what I said. Never, ever, ever, ever let anyone feel like you are not worthy of being happy because you are. Everyone is worthy of being happy. And at the end of the day, I just try and be a good person. I try my hardest, my damn hardest, damn, 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 damn hardest to be the best person that I can be for myself. And then the universe will provide the rest. I promise you it will. It will. 
what you put out is what you get back and that's simple as that. Okay, guys, I love you all so much and until next time, bye.